welcome back. How you doing? Um, obviously, welcome back if you followed the other video, but if you are brand new to the channel, then just welcome in general. How are you doing? Yes, I'm Larry, packed up anywhere. And um, so on the last video, on the previous video, we covered uh, Tala Anjum's response to Neezy's podcast comments. And now we're on Neezy's response to Tala Anjum's response to the response of the comments. Yes, that made sense. And follow the logic there, right there. Uh, all right, so look, we're just gonna get straight into it. And um, no more talking anymore. Watching, if you haven't subscribed, please do it. Just do it. All right, I'm not gonna hit play until you do it. I'm just kidding, because I'm gonna hit play because then I'm, what the fuck am I gonna do just sat here? But uh, saying that though, I am actually watching the Euros right now and uh, it is currently halftime, Spain versus Croatia and Spain are absolutely spanking, spanking Croatia right now. It is 3-0 and the uh, second half is about to start. So I'm just, it's, it's all three games so far in the Euros in the first two days have been like meh. Just one team takes over and then that's the end of that match. Um, but, you know, at least Croatia made it a little bit more interesting. They took it up until about the 20th minute or something like that. And then they started conceding. But uh, obviously Albania play later on tonight, which is Saturday night. And uh, they play Italy. Yes, they do. They play Italy. And that's going to be... That's going to be fun to watch. And uh, I have absolutely no delusions that... Albania are going to do anything against Italy, but on the off chance, it would be amazing. So anyway, uh, right. So forget that. Let's just get straight into this. This is so Nisi's reply. This is called Napak. Uh, Napak means evil. Rap the local videos. Thank you so much for covering this. And uh, no more talking about watching. Let's do it. Yeah. Nisi. Nisi. Oh. So this is the point that I made in the last video. Um, I haven't covered Neezy before, so I don't really know his style. But just I'm just gonna run it back real quick on like on the last sort of few lines that he had. And is this sort of on purpose, or did he just completely forget how to rap and just turn amateur? Like what just happened? Hold on. Let's just go back a little bit. That is not good. I think that's probably the only way I can say that. I don't really want to, like, you know, mince words or anything. That is not good. Like, call it flow or whatever, but it just doesn't sound... Yeah. Just have to go back a little bit and just make sure that I have that right. Wait, I mean, he said you don't know me, but like, 
you're the one who said you didn't know him, and he obviously knows who you are. So I don't. Hold on. The clever people recognize you, but I don't know you. So what does that mean that you're not a clever person? What? So wait, wait, hold on a second. So now, did you do research after Tala Anjum's diss track dropped? Or did you know clearly who the fuck Tala Anjum is? Like, I just want to know, all I'm saying is, I just want to know the backstory, like, you know, before before the whole podcast thing. Like, what was going on? Was there something happening that I'm not aware of or I should be aware of? Because if it just started from a simple question on a podcast and then he answered the way he did, then it's just like, well, you're just a liar, aren't you? <laughs> like, I mean, you just mentioned two of his fucking tracks. What did you do? I'm sure, well, okay, so I'm, I'm thinking, obviously, the most likely scenario is that he did the research after Tala Anjum's diss track because I think it was maybe like a couple of days before uh, before he just dropped this. But... You know, it's just sometimes it's like, bro, you need you you guys need to understand like what you're saying right now. Right, I'm sorry, but no, I've, I've lost interest in this now. Like, I don't know what the fuck he's talking about. Um, like, I'm, I'm just... Yeah, I'm not... Spit on your face, right, okay, yeah, that's... You know, whatever. Um, alright, yeah, no, I think I'm done with that track, I'll be honest. Um, that didn't... No, that wasn't... Shit, that wasn't... Fuck, that was not good. Um... I'd say tell me differently in the comments, but I'm pretty sure that not many people are going to like this track um, because it's just, it's just not that good, especially when you compare it to fucking Tala Andrew one. Like, come on, bro. You know, if you're going to fucking diss a man like that, you're going to disrespect him like that and just be like, I don't know who he is. You better fucking bring your air game. Do you know, air, air game? Yeah, your air game, like Air Jordan game. No, you better bring your A game. That's what I'm trying to say. Um... You know, because that, that shit, this shit right here in the pack, which means evil, this shit was not evil. This shit was like the softest fucking bullshit I've ever heard in my life. This was trash, man. Um, yeah, and I'll happily say it. I don't give a fuck. I just let your opinions be known in the comments. And if I have time, I will comment back. But if I don't have time, well, you know, so what? But anyways, um, let me know in the comments. Yeah, whatever you think, whatever your thoughts are, whatever your opinions, just hit me up and I will uh, get to them as whenever I can. And uh, yeah, so I'll catch you in the next one. Until then, stay safe. Stay alert.